Hello, my name's Louise Blackwell and I'm the Creative Director of Creative Crawley. Creative Crawley is an arts charity um, and we exist to bring surprising artworks to Crawley and to support creative people locally. I'm Sophie Eustace, I'm one of the co-project directors of Creative Playground. Creative Playground is one of Creative Crawley's projects, which is part of a national network of 39 different places around the UK that is um, supporting people to engage with arts and culture who don't necessarily have access to it. Around the Lake Festival, we asked local people the kinds of things that they wanted to see happening in Crawley, and a lot of people were very passionate about the green spaces here, particularly Tilgate Park, which is absolutely beautiful, as you can see. So we're wanting to make Crawley a cultural destination explore imaginative, high quality, family friendly set of brilliant activities that you can either participate in or watch. There are very few opportunities for local artists and so we want to try and kind of help them create a scene and actually presenting work as well so that so that people in the town can understand that the, there's amazing talent here. Hi, so I'm Ifit, I'm a spoken word artist from Crawley, I'm 19. I've been writing for about five years now. Having that kind of access to poetry, whether it's through school events or um, events like this, where you know the community can just come out for free and just watch some like some poetry, is just great and does make it more accessible. It's great. And we also want to bring in extraordinary talent from around the world in order to kind of raise that ambition and to show people what's possible. So my name's Divija and I perform with the company Trigger and we've been performing the show called Tea Break. Actually it's my first time in Crowley and it's so amazing to just see this and such a beautiful atmosphere and just to see people come out and engage with the arts because sometimes theatre spaces are so they're inaccessible sometimes and this is just people are out for a walk and they get to see art so yeah it's so super important. So, hi I'm Christina Elaine. I'm Shade Elaine and we're from Elaine Dance which is our company and we love to focus on performance, participation and development. You know you have the accidental audiences that have maybe never seen something like this before. It's wonderful and the feedback that we received it's, uh, it's really moving it makes us want to do more performances in places like this. The whole thing's been great and that show was just really, really fantastic. I guess it's good to associate art with just like community spaces rather than somewhere you have to pay to get in. Oh, I think it's amazing, I really do think it's amazing. Something unique as well. Yeah, it's something unique and I think for all community to enjoy. Yeah, you can just walk around and stumble across the show, it's something that you've never had thought that you could watch or that you had planned to watch, so you have to pay to watch. With um, Crossings, which is the series of rowing boats by the artist Luke Jerem, who's internationally acclaimed, with an audio piece that you listen to while you're rowing the boat, we commissioned one from a fantastic local resident, Parveen Khan, who's told us her story of crossing continents as a, as a young Muslim woman. And the weekends, having a bit of relaxed time, hearing some stories on the boat, especially for like young family with little kids. It's really good to have a lot of things to do and get this little one entertained. Oh, it was truly amazing. It really inspires you. I think it brings people, uh, it brings community together. Basically, I'm from India. I don't have any family here, so I can look around, I can feel connected to the society. Uh, so that is really important, which uh, is missing uh, where we are today. So, yeah, it helps. There's a lot of work to be done, but um, we are meeting so many people who are very proud of this town and, and they feel it deserves kind of really high quality creativity and art happening here, which is what we're, we're all about.